Alright, here it is, the great uh, steam bending machine set up to go. We've got uh, plastic on the wheel here so that the glue don't stick. I got my peg in place so that the arch from the steam bending wood will stay flatter. Um, I got the water boiling as you can hear. This is my storage rack where I store stuff because I don't have much storage in the garage so uh, everything is steam bending related goes up here. Also, this cap is not glued on. Not glued on. For safety reasons because uh, we don't want any pressure in this tube. Uh, we don't want a boiler or pressure. And um, that way, it's uh, if it ever builds up too much pressure, it can push the end off or this end off. I got vent holes up in here so that the steam is forced to travel all the way through the length of the tube and out here. I got a flap here so that uh, when I'm steam bending, let me if I get this lined up right here. Put my screw back in. Uh, so I can uh, pull the uh, wood out and still be heated got my seat clamps here so that uh, I can uh, have a real easy access to when I'm putting them on this is all my jigs so that uh, when I'm bending Blue pot. I'm using a tie bond on these first ones just so I can uh, get used to it. But I do have high glue for the the future rims coming out. And that's it. That's the great steam bending machine. I added my old man's flag he, before he passed away. Used to hang this flag out in his garage and stuff. So I added the flag yesterday in honor of him. Found it when I was cleaning out some stuff in my in his barn. And there she be.